Hey yo, what is going on? It's your boy Kraken here with another video on the channel. And so today, guys, I do have some sad news for the Fortnite mobile community. Um, so as you guys might know, today was September 28th, the final court hearing for Fortnite versus Apple. Uh, not the final because it was moved to July 2021, which is 10 months. And let's get into more detail on Twitter. So let's get right into it, guys. Alright guys, so um, here we go, Fortnite Mobile community on Twitter. Well, this is pretty much the end of Fortnite Mobile. It will be almost a whole year, 10 months, yes, until the next trial, uh, meaning the court, court trial. And it's really, it really sucks. I mean, if Fortnite was like, yeah, uh, go ahead, it's okay, we'll change the price back to $10, I mean... Fortnite Mobile would have been saved, and us, Fortnite Mobile, would have been Now, you guys might be wondering, why am I doing this when I quit Fortnite? So, unfortunately, I didn't tell YouTube yet that I am back on Fortnite, but I actually started playing on PC. Um, but I do also play mobile for my mobile fam, uh, and yeah. So, 10 months without Fortnite Mobile, um, like, we can't just be stuck in Season 3 for 10 months. That's just going to be a big oof for the Fortnite mobile community. Fortnite has to do something for this. Um, yeah, Epic versus Apple next court hearing will be January 6, 2020. And Fortnite mobile did not return today. So if you guys go on the App Store and search Fortnite, it's still not there. Um, but we still get to keep it if you still have it downloaded. Um, and yeah, we can assume that Apple won for now. But... Next court here in January 6th, and let's hope we might win. But, like, so far, they're saying 10 months is the highest. Uh, wait. Okay, I'm confused. The next trial, July 2021 or January 6th? The, okay, no, the court hearing is on the 6th, and the trial is on the ten, uh, up to 10 months. So, it is sad, um, unfortunately, and it is what it is. Um, we have Surfing Boy Pit, uh, and he decided, and he also made this video at the end of Fortnite Mobile. Um, Fortnite has to do something, like, I don't know, I mean, it's probably too late to just apologize to Apple and make the price back to $10, and, yeah, I mean, it's what it is. Um, Fortnite did make a mistake doing that, because they lost more than 60,000 Fortnite Mobile players, um, and that's just sucks. It just sucks. It really sucks. Um, but please go ahead and follow me on Twitter. I'll be posting more stuff. I only posted like one thing for Absorber to get it to uh, Phase Clan, um, Phase Absorber. Okay. <laughs> but it sucks how Fortnite Mobile is still banned. Um, we lost our hopes of it coming back today, but it is what it is again. But yeah, um, please subscribe to the channel, like this video. I mean, and comment. How you're feeling right now. If you're a Fortnite mobile player. How you're feeling about this. Um, to be honest. like I, I'm a Fortnite mobile content creator. And I feel terrible. Um, even though I switched to PC. Like most of my videos. Not most. Like all of my videos were on mobile. As you guys know. And it just sucks. How uh, this is going to just go away now. Um, but yeah, and I'll see you all, I guess, in the next video. Peace.